golf club and your hands need to stay in this cone. Right, we had, I had that, you know, the first time. Right, so you're going up here. And, I, and you come down way underneath. The club is way underneath the cone, Joan. Okay. See where the club is? It's coming way underneath that yellow right, cone. Right, so yeah. that's too far from the inside. Mm -hmm. And that's why you hit the ground and hit behind the ball. So again, your hands need to be up here. When you come into the ball, that golf club is coming in way too shallow. Mm -hmm. And that's why you hit behind it consistently. So what I got to get you to do is get your hands over your head more. Get your club more in front of you. You swing the club too far around your body. Okay. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Here's Jordan Spieth. You've ever heard of Jordan Spieth? You better believe it. He is amazing. I just love him. Yeah. Watch his backswing because he doesn't look like that. Okay, watch what his club does. His hands are closer to his head. Let me show you another picture. Okay, right. That makes that makes sense. I can relate to that. See where his hands are there? Yeah. Now, they're way above his head, are they not? They're way up above his head, aren't they? Mm-hmm. Well, where are your hands in relationship yeah, to your... Yeah, my shoulders. <laughs> yeah. Oh, gracious. Yeah. So we got to get your hands above mm -hmm. your head. So in your front of your mirror at home, uh -huh. in your bathroom mirror, I want you to practice bringing your hands over your head. You get in front of your bathroom <laughs> mirror and do that. Yeah, because it's going to be easier said than done, but I sure relate to what you're saying. Oh, it's not that hard. Oh, okay. You can do it. you got the skills to do it. But watch where his golf club comes it down. Such bad habits, though. Watch this, Joan. So watch, watch what he does now. Watch his club. Watch on the big screen here. Oh, okay. His club goes in the cone up. Now see where his hands are. All right, look where, where are your hands. They're lower, right? Okay. Now watch where his club comes down. Where is that club coming in? Yeah, it sure is nice and inside in it. In that cone, right? Now, where's your club coming yeah. in? <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Your hands are in the cone, but the club is too far behind you. Okay. You see how the club head is way back in behind yeah, you here. And the club head is what's got to hit the ball. Yeah. yeah. So we got to get the club head inside of that yellow cone. Mm -hmm. Easier said than done. No, it's not that hard. <laughs> oh, goodness. But we can get it done. That's not that hard. We can get it done. So your hands, I'm going to give you a drill. Joan, come over here. We're not done yet. All right, so envision this. I'm going to show you a drill. You're going to... Okay, yeah, that's what I need. Okay, this is a wall drill. You're going to put your rear end right against the wall at your house. Okay. You're going to take the club back, and guess what? Oh, D wow. Don't hit the wall. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I'm going to show you how not to do it. You see, Joan, your club is going to hit the wall there. You're not allowed to hit this wall. This is your wall right here. Okay. The club head's not allowed to hit the wall. Oh, wow. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm in trouble. <laughs> All right. I'm going to show you outside. This is the wall drill. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, you're going to practice the wall drill. Uh, uh, uh. So right here, Joan, when you get to right here, your arms have got to go straight up. up instead of round. They got to go up. Yeah. They can't go around, or you're going to hit. <laughs> sure. You're going to whack the wall. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, but you can do that. 